welcome to the Dragons TV highlights. Are you looking forward to this one, John? Hi, Ted. That's a good question, and one I will answer later. Okay, John. Sitting on the fence, I see. Well, tonight, the Dragons welcome back Andy McKinney and James Shaw. So here we are, John. The teams are out on the ice, and the old land of my fathers has been sung. That song always gives me goosebumps, John. Ah, yes, Ted. Hen Vlad Fee Nado. Such a powerful national anthem, I do agree. And as you correctly pointed out, Ted, the Dragons have more power tonight with the return of Andy McKinney and James Shaw. Let's hope the Dragons can bring home the bacon and get the win tonight. Okay, John, and so here we go in this must-win game for the Dragons. And right off the bat here, John, the Barons are pressing the Dragons. Oh, calm down, Ted. You need to take a chill pill. The Dragons are looking composed with the puck in their own D-zone. You're right, John. I think I called that a little too early. Apart from icing the puck already. The Dragons win the puck from the face-off, and there is a chance for a breakaway. Ross does one of his spinny passy moves, but Andy McKinney fails to pick up the puck. But Padzer collects the puck. Oh, just a little too far and fast. A brilliant break by the Dragons almost broke through. Woo! And that is surely a two-minute penalty for Wayney there? Looks like you're right, Ted. Wayney is in the bin. So the opening has seen the Dragons controlling the game so far, but it's still nil-nil here at the den. The Dragons do well to take control of the puck here, and it looks like they could be on the break. MJ is on the break here, chasing the puck down, and Woo! Wins the battle in the corner. The puck is with Shaw, who passes out to Monkey. Monkey shoots, Monkey scores. Booyah! Get in. Chris Jones, what a goal. Let's check out the Asprey Chester action cam replay. Okay, John. Here we go, MJ, chasing down the puck, slamming into the boards. Out of shot, he gets the puck out. Monkey on the loose puck, buries it in the back of the net. Whoa! There it is. One nil to the Dragons. If that goal was a stake, it would be rare. Ooh, steady on, John. Okay, we pick up with the Dragons applying more pressure on the power play here, with Andy McKinney and Matt Wainwright playing pass down in the corner. McKinney takes the puck round the back of the net. His pass finds Kennedy in oodles of space. He shoots! He scores! Pick that one out. What a screamer there from Ross Kennedy. Let's check the Asprey Chester action cam replay. Any moment now, you will see McKinney fly by from left to right. My left or your left, Ted? The viewer's left, John! Come on! There he goes! Passes the puck out to Ross yeah. Kennedy. He shoots, he scores! Oh, hold on, Ted. Did Mark Level tap that in? I think he gets the slightest of touches. Let's take a closer look. I am not sure, John. The replay is inconclusive, but I will say... Get on that rhythm now! I'ma say! Booyah! Okay, back to it, here in the second period, and the Dragons turn the puck over and break. Ross tries the shot, ah! But it's blocked by the keeper's pads and bounced back into play. Are you okay, Ted? No, John, I am not. I just got electrocuted by the mic. But here comes the Barons on the attack. Whoa! Man down, man down, man down! Look at him glide. Barons still have a chance here, John. But it is getting a bit wishy-washy out there. Barons have the puck. Nope. Dragons have the puck. No one wants to keep the puck. Here we go, Ted. Decide break and find some space. Paza plays it back to McKinney. McKinney out to Kennedy. Coiled like a spring, he lets one fly. Whoa! Off the skate of the Barons player, and they break! Nope. McKinney wins the puck back. Ah! But the chance goes begging! But still, D-side are pressing forward. This line is putting in one hell of a shift. Oh, but now the Barons turn the puck over and break forward. He shoots! Croyle saves! Well, that was an intense opening to the second period, John. You can say that again, Ted. Well, that was an intense opening to the second period, John. Not literally, Ted. 
Okay, back to more of the action in the second period here, and the Dragons are on the break. Whoa! Down, goes MJ. So this should give the Dragons the power play advantage, John. That's right, Ted. Hey, has anyone ever called you Captain Obvious before? Now that you mention it, John. Yes, all the time. Okay, here we go. Dragons on the power play. The puck has been lost, and the Barons are on a one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, no! Barons have scored a shorthanded goal. That's painful. What was more painful, Ted, the electric shock off the mic or that goal? Hmm, I think they were as bad as each other. Let's check out the Asprey Chester action cam replay. Okay, so we can see the Dragons player just got mugged there, and here comes the Barons player. Not a lot Croyle could have done there, to be honest, John. It seems there was some confusion with the Dragons players, unsure if the new 20 mile per hour speed limit applies to people on skates. Well, does it? I don't know, John. I just commentate. Okay, and we are off in the third and final period. The Dragons need a big performance here. McKinney and Waney are playing pass again. McKinney passes the puck to Ross. Ross lays it off for Waney. Waney lays it off to Paz. He shoots! Keeper blocks! Dragons keep control of the puck. Passing it about nicely. But the Dragons still have the puck. We have a scuffle on the boards trying to dig the puck out. Still scuffling. Waney gets the puck. When he shoots, the keeper has dropped it. Goal! It looks like Alex Perry has put it in the back of the net. Booyah! Great play there from the Dragons. Let's check out the Asprey Chester action cam replay. There's the shot coming Keeper in. Keeper spills it. And Paza pokes it home to make it D-side three. Sully Hall one. Great goal, Ted. Right place at the right time. Well, after the Dragons' third goal, this game has gone a little bit scrappy. But the Dragons continue to press on. Puck to Ross, who has 37.8% of the rink to himself. He shoots. Maybe could have passed it over the McKinney there. Some good play there from the Dragons. Unfortunately, not to have added another goal there. Dragons win the faceoff. Waney shoots, but hits another Dragons player. The Barons try to break, but the Dragons keep up the pressure here. The Barons try to come forward again. The Dragon's working hard here to get the puck back. Nope, they had it and lost it. Chance for the Barons. hoo -ah, He's fluffed it! The Dragon's break away! Jessen launches one! But this time, the Keeper keeps hold of the puck. The Dragon's win the face-off but it looks like the Barons have won it back and are looking for the breakaway. Oh, that was a great interception by the Dragons there. Bit of a battle on the boards here. The Dragons keep control of the puck. Jared brings the puck forward with real intent here. Lays it off for Jessen. What a goal. It sure was Ted. Let's take another look at the Asprey Chester action cam replay. Here we see Jared down the boards. Great vision to pick out Jessen there. And boom! That really was something special there, Ted. Control, power, and accuracy. 
Dragons for Barons one. It was that good John. Let's slow it down. What did you say, Ted? It looks even better in slow motion, John. I agree, Ted. I agree. So here we are in the final two minutes remaining in the third. A scrappy face-off from the Dragons there keeps them under pressure on the penalty kill. The Barons keep looking for a way through here. Chance! Oh! Just wide! And the Dragons return to full strength. Here we go, final stretch here. The Dragons need to just keep the puck. The Dragons are doing exactly what they need to do here. Controlling the game. Another goal would sure be nice though. McKinney on the puck looking for options. Whoa! Blatant trip there! No penalty called! What the f- He did call it Ted. Oh sorry, my bad. Sorry John. Ross on the puck. But he cannot find that killer pass. Dragons still have the puck. Alex shoots, shot blocked, he gets the puck back. Dragons win the faceoff and keep looking for options here with less than one minute remaining in the game. Barons clear the zone. And that's the game. Dragons take the win 4-1. So there we have it, Tom. The Dragons finally have their first win of the season. That's right, John. I told you earlier that the Dragons would bring home the win today. It was great to see Monkey get his first goal of the season tonight. And with the return of McKinney and Shaw, they definitely made a difference. Ah, yes, James Shaw and his magic toe. It was a great team effort tonight, Ted, just what the doctor ordered. By the way, Ted, where did you get your new t-shirt? Oh, I made it myself, John. I'm thinking of letting the club sell them. Would you like one, John? I'm okay for now. Thanks, Ted. So, Dragons fans, thank you for watching, and we hope to see you on Sunday when we face the much-improved Sheffield Scimitars. That's right, John. Book online now to save some money. And remember to always be, be more, more Dragon. Dragon. Jinx!